All right, guys, today we're riding the 2023 Polaris Sportsman 570. This is the Ride Command Edition. It has 44 horsepower, a one-cylinder, 567cc engine. It weighs just shy of 900 pounds. It has a hitch rating of 1350 and a four and a half gallon fuel tank. Price on this is $12,400. It has 11 and a half inches of ground clearance. It's automatic. It also has on demand all wheel drive. This is actually my first time ever riding an ATV. So we're out here at Holly Oaks off road park up in Holly, Michigan. And we're gonna give you guys some first impressions on this first riding experience. Charlie's booked this for the month with uh, the Daily Motor and Winding Road YouTube channels. And I figured I'd take it out, have a go and just kind of see what this is like. Different experience. I've ridden jet skis, I've ridden snowmobiles, first time on an ATV. So we're gonna take it easy, be a little cautious, but on first impressions, it's super fun, super easy to ride. We've got two wheel drive, four wheel drive. We'll try driving around in both and see how we like it. Nice information display showing our fuel level, engine temp, RPM, voltage, direction. We can also, uh, there's a navigation that we can get into as well. You can see a map. Usually if you're on an ORV trail, it'll show you your trail. Today, we're just in this park, so it's not really gonna show us a whole lot of information here. Lots of different information we can cycle through here. Here's our switch between two-wheel drive and four-wheel drive. Rear brake is down here, front brake is up here. All the way forward to be in high, back one to be in low. But should be able to have some fun in this thing. Let's go do a little lap of the park, see how it goes. Well, we've got a proper flag mount here. That seems to be the best solution. Just tighten it down like crazy. This piece, just plastic, cheap, it breaks. So, gotta have a bar mount. We're gonna try this a little bit in two wheel drive. Okay. Cool, so we're in two wheel drive. Should be locked in there. It's not gonna be in four wheel drive auto.
short. It's just getting through stuff as a breeze. in the elements you can taste the dirt you're not enclosed it's just fun
Yeah, this will get through a lot and just rear wheel drive. So much fun. So much more fun, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this is a good time. I mean, so school me a little bit more on like where this sits in ATV, yeah. you know, world. So you, you'd get something like this for something around home because it's got the winch installed. You can, it's even got a plow mode built in. You got the tow hitch on the back. Nice. You can go out and have some fun like this, but really you're coming out right now and doing, uh, you know, you're know, you taking a, a base Jeep Wrangler out and flogging it. Yeah. Um, or a base Bronco or something like that. Cool. Um, so in terms of four wheeler land, I mean, there's a lot more performance you can get. You can get all the way up to a thousand CC and, and twice the power of this. Uh, you can get more of a dedicated rear wheel drive only like sports machine like like Can-Am makes and you don't have as much of the plastic it's lighter okay um, so this is a good intro into the sport and I mean you were running around in just uh, low power steering mode but you can dial up medium or high if you're doing low speed like okay. mud type of maneuvers or through the, the right. heavy trails or if you're plowing um, so yeah you can absolutely get something like this and go and have fun but you've got the utility areas you know you've got the storage underneath you've got oh yeah the winch. i didn't take a look at the storage up front you just pop this pop this it's about five and a half liters okay waterproofed cool um so just enough to have your owner's manuals and a little snack or we had two water bottles and some gloves and my camera equipment kind of tucked in here yeah so. waterproof that's nice yeah battery um yeah, you know, different different lights and everything like that. It's it's uh, kind of trying to be a jack of all trades. Um, suspension isn't super advanced. Powertrain isn't super advanced. These but, tires are nice. Yeah, tires have seemed good. Um, it's uh, it'll get the job done. Sure. And for someone like you, you know, first time on an ATV, getting to kind of play around with it. It's, yeah. It's, it's good. Did some donuts. Oh yeah. Got it on two oh. wheels. Felt fun. Nice. nice. <laughs> yeah, the, the limits are very approachable. I mean, yeah. you you can really have a lot of impact over the machine, but unlike a, something like a dirt bike, you, you don't fall over. Exactly. Sure. <laughs> Unless you really mess up. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. All right, well, thanks, man. This was fun. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Uh, many of you probably know a whole lot more about it than I do. <laughs> But uh, yeah, Charlie booked this for the last month. He's been playing around with it, but this is kind of our first opportunity to really take it out off road. Mm -hmm. And uh, you were having some fun. You were ripping in this thing. Yeah, you were too. Once you got, got comfortable, you were really, yeah. really playing around. It's um, very capable. Mm -hmm. It's cool just like using your whole body to do this too. Yes. You are a part of the equation. You're out in the open, you're in the elements. Right. It's kind of scary in some sections. Like you get a little tilted and it's like, oh, uh, you know. Right. You really feel how you kind of move your butt out Yes. And, you, and you shift your weight over and then the machine settles in yeah and and it's a little bit more of an intimate relationship and, and this one's heavy it's over 700 pounds but you get something more like a, a sportier one you're looking at more four or five hundred then you really are a part of the equation cool yeah cool yeah all right well that'll be it for this one good job charlie's gonna go rip around a little bit more yeah thanks for watching guys we'll see you in the next one take care
Did it? Yeah, that was awesome. You <laughs> killed it. <laughs> probably would have been probably a little easier in four low, but I, I that was high could, and it, it yeah, powered maybe, through. Maybe it would have multiplied the torque a little bit. Yeah. Um, it was kind of just the, the sketchiness of like, I don't know how much weight's <laughs> on my front. You just had to ride it out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's the thing. Once that's you get steep. to a certain point and it's it's better to keep going. Yeah, yeah, yeah you just had to stay, keep in it. That yeah. was awesome. <laughs> Got it all on camera. Nice. Did you see through the smoke? Oh yeah, yeah, it was a good shot.